Good day to you and welcome to another stupid video. I'm still in uh, my favorite campground in View Bocao. I'm a little bit delayed. I should already have been on my way to Portugal by now and we'll get there, but it's going to be a couple of more weeks. One of the things that is currently holding me here is a doctor's appointment for my arm. Uh, it's a little bit fucked up. There's an, a nerve that is being compressed in my left elbow, causing a little bit of a tingling sensation in my two fingers. So that needs to be taken care of. I think they need to do some surgery. So in fact, I might even be delayed more than a couple of weeks. But this certainly isn't a bad spot to be delayed in. And here comes the cat. Hey, Balskin. Magnelle driver. This food is not for you. It's for the wildcats. First, you have some buddies in the campground. We're going to go and feed them. Opus. There are like four wildcats here. One is an orange cat. He hangs out in the woods. He doesn't come here so often. But three cats, all females, they hang right here by the service station and no one really knows how they ended up here, but this is their little corner. Someone has built a cat house for the cats by the trees here. Let's see if we can get them to come out. Come on. There is one cat, hey. 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 Where are all your friends? There's supposed to be three of you. All of the three cats, they look pretty much the same. They have the, like the same color, the same fur, the same size. Hey, yo, oh, oh fuck. Come on. The fuck? Everything stuck to the lid. Oh gosh, I have to wash up now. Here, lick my finger instead. Where are all your buddies? Are they sleeping? Sucked. Oh, fuck. No, hey, puppies. No. <laughs> I have to go wash my finger. One funny detail about these cats is that when I feed them, they want to cuddle so much all the time and not eat. They only eat my food after I've left the site, meaning I have to come back for the dishes afterwards. Another problem is all the dogs that are running around here on the campground, unleashed. The cats are naturally afraid of the dogs. That's probably why only one cat came out. They usually don't like to come out in the middle of the day because of all the dogs. So what I have to do, because they just want to cuddle and not eat this food, is I have to put it inside their little house here. They have the most adorable meow, these cats. Such a high pitched meow. This place is a little bit more lively now compared to the last time I shot a video here. They have cleaned up the algae and there's people everywhere. We are going to go into the village. There's an abandoned place there. A couple of videos ago, I was having my drone up in the air and we shot some footage from the abandoned place, but I think I know a way in. There are so much people here, it's insane. This is the place, uh, the abandoned place, and I believe there's an open door here. No, they closed it. That door over there was open before. Let's go and see if we can push it open. It's barricaded from inside, so this doesn't budge. Oh well, I tried. I tried. It's extremely hot outside and I wanted to buy an ice cream, specifically from this place here in the left corner. And so I asked this restaurant over here if I could sit in the corner over there while I eat my ice cream. And they said, no, you have to buy something off of the menu to be allowed to sit in the corner over there to eat an ice cream. Meaning, this restaurant here is not so customer friendly. If you're in Jubokao, uh, don't come to this restaurant and eat your food. But I'm still getting my ice cream. It is seriously hot outside. I'm sweating. 
and I am supposed to go down further south towards Portugal. I have a few doubts about that, to be honest, because it's not going to get colder. It's just going to get hotter. Mm. That was five and a half euros well spent. Here in France, you shouldn't really be crossing a crosswalk like that unless you want to get killed because they drive cars like crazy here. I'm going to do something stupid now just for this video. I know a place here where they make the ice cream on demand. It's super cool. That gives me a good excuse to have a second ice cream, right? He didn't take a credit card and I don't have any cash. So that means no more ice cream for me. But I suppose that's a good thing, right? Now we're going to go and do some grocery shopping instead. And in here is where I wanted to do grocery shopping, but they are closed, obviously. So I can't do that either. Uh, it's Tuesday today. Mardi, mercredi, jeudi, 8.30 to 13. Ah, Jesus. They are only open in the morning. Meaning I have a big problem because I'm running low on fruits. But I have something else I want to show you. If I can find it. Aha, here we go. This building looks like it's from a completely different time era. This is so, so cool. It's almost like artwork, like someone painted this building to look this way. It's like from a movie, almost surreal. I, for one, I am always astounded when I see old, old buildings like this. So interesting. This is an old sign that they have covered to some extent. And a number, I think this was a number that they are trying to conceal. Why would they want to conceal a number on the building? That's weird. I think this hook right here is so that they can lock this border on the window when it is open. That fucking ice cream is calling my name, so I have to do this. Bonjour. Bonjour. Hey, I would like an ice cream. Yes. Yeah. Je voudrais deux par oui. parfum. <laughs> yeah, I know the system. I know the system. What do we want? Um, a pistache. Oui. Also Kinder Bueno. And for the topping? A uh, praline. Okay. Just one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's Hello. actually it's my second ice cream today actually. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for sure. Hello, five rupees. And there it was a number says. Okay, Six. says. Okay. Yes. Is that the pistache? Yes. Nice. And a little bit of chocolate. And what is this liquid? It's a uh, cream with milk and it's a... Uh, you speak French? No. A little, no. <laughs> it's uh, English cream. Cream, yeah. yeah English. Yeah. And voila. Ah. Okay, merci beaucoup. <laughs> Super. Ice cream number two, here we go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, really good. My personal trainer back at the campsite, he's going to be so angry with me when he sees this video. I can't have it all. I'm not going to be able to eat everything. This was good ice cream. So if you're ever in Dubokau, you have to visit this place. Pros and roll. Adios. Ciao. Uh, uh, au revoir. Au revoir. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. I should have learned how to say goodbye in French by now. Okay, I'm going to take you to one last place um, before we go back to the campground. We are approaching the ocean. This is just one of many paths you can take to go down to the beach. And here, You'll find a little bit of restaurants, bars, and that kind of stuff. I guess the summer has arrived, huh?
This is what I wanted to show you. I don't know what this is, but today we'll find out. Do you see the houses built on top of the sand? That is so cool. Should we take a detour and go and look at the houses? Maybe. Well, you can't get in here. Let's try the other side. Oh no, it's kind of blocked off. There doesn't appear to be a way in there anyways. Okay, fuck this. I mean, just look at this view. It's absolutely amazing. This is the view you get if you buy one of the houses here. Absolutely stunning. It's priceless. I hate insects. I hate sand in my shoes. I hate cold weather. I hate my mom. And the list goes on. I'm gonna have to make a video on all the things I hate, but sand is one of them. Why do shoes collect sand inside anyway? It shouldn't be like that. They should make better shoes. I even have sh sand in my socks now. Fuck, I have sand all over. Okay, this was the last time I went to a beach. Oh gosh. And I'm sweating like a fucking monkey. Why is it so bloody hot? God is not kind to me today. Can you see how much I'm sweating? It's sick. Is this place abandoned? It looks abandoned. No, 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 no. They have been cleaning up here, so it's not abandoned. The house itself looks abandoned, it does. Isn't that cool? These houses built on the sand. And this is just the first part of this road. It, it continues. I'll show you how the road continues. Oh, gosh, it's so warm. Holy shit. Here's the road, it continues, basically on sand. And then you have all kinds of houses spread out on the sand. I need to get back to the campground, to the shade. <laughs> it's, this is too hot for me. Holy shit. I made it back to the... <laughs> Bajskin. <laughs> Bajskin. He's trying to play with the camera. So cute. I just made it back to safe ground. The car is parked in shade and it's actually quite cool in the car. I'm really not good with hot, wet, super hot weather like today. I'm burning up and I'm going to go down south to Portugal was the plan. Yeah, we'll see how that goes. <laughs> Bye, Ski. Are we going to go up north or are we going to go south? I've been to Portugal, I actually lived there a couple of months, but Balski and my car ha hasn't been to Portugal. So we are going to go there. Now I'm going to go to the beach and I'm going to sunbathe a little bit to get some color on my legs. Like I'm brown, but my legs, they are like super white. I'll cut back to you later. Do you hear that? <laughs> that's, that's my cat. Hey, Batkin. <laughs> hey, hey, that's a come home now. Hey, bud, skin. Titta, we can little sat. What person? Hmm. Yeah, the fin. What the me, puss? Yeah, the fin. Mwah, puss. Hmm. You are going to get a really good dinner tonight. Oh yeah, shift it. No me parece que no fue por eso. Parece you know the same drill every night. You never get to be there when I make you food. Sauce snack. What do we have in here? Hmm? That bar skin. Oh. Never oh. fun. Oh. It's burnt the clock, but I... Stress it. Oh. Barski, what's in there? Sit. What's in there? Every night we have the same routine. I'm trying to make him food and he's trying to 
walk around in the area where I make the food, but he knows he's not allowed to start eating <laughs> until after I've said so. So he, he won't even start to eat before I have given him, given him permission to do so, but he's going to walk around and disturb me all the time. Hmm? Oh. I always give him, I always give him three bags, one normal cat food, wet cat food bag with some treat on top and liquid sauce. And he's always, no matter how I put this in the bowl, he's always going to find and eat the cream first, then the snack, and lastly, maybe all of this. Add some snacks here, put that right in, and then we add some cream on top. Oh, disgusting. And that's exactly why I put your tray on a piece of paper. I have to pick this shit up. Oh, and now he wants more sauce. Now that he has been eating food, I don't want to kiss him, but he's going to try to kiss me now because he's begging for a new uh, sauce. Hmm? Mm, but... oh. <laughs> uh. I've been trying to make him to eat up all his food first before he gets the sauce. But that's hard because I always give in. Do you see that? I have so many problems with this left arm. I can crack it, I can twist it, I can make it do funny sounds. But the right arm I have no problems with. The left arm, he makes all these sounds all the time. Super weird sounds. That's one of the things I'm going to check up um, with the doctor next week before I leave France. I hope you enjoyed watching my cat eat. Um, pretty easy to make that type of content. You know, just hold a camera and let the cat do his job. Before I end the video, actually, this is a good note. If you live in a camping car and you're like me, you're afraid of bugs, just get a cat because they kill every bug. He's the best insect killer right here. He saw something by the door and now he's going to sit there for half an hour until he, until he has caught the, the bug. Isn't that cute? That concludes this video. Thank you for watching. Me and Barsky will see you another time.